When it comes to candy, a local dental group is offering to buy back your kids' Halloween candy this year, and they're donating that candy to a great cause. Joining us now live this morning to talk about the program is Dr. Sean Anderson with Willow Dental Group. Doctor, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Uh, thank you for having me. I appreciate it. Of course. And now this program this is not the first year, second year. This is the ninth year of the program. Why do this? Why buy back Halloween candy? Well, it's like I always told my kids growing up. It's like I want to get all that stuff off the streets. So <laughs> we want to. And so we were trying to figure out a way about 10 years ago how we could really help the kids and patients in our practice who said, I have all this leftover candy. What am I going to do with it? Because I don't want to keep it in the house for the kids. And so we teamed up with Move America Forward, and they will actually take all of the candy and they give it to our U.S. service members and also our local first responders as a little token of gratitude so you know when they're serving overseas they get a little piece of candy again in moderation and so that way we can actually take the candy we will give two dollars per pound up to five pounds wow. for anybody that comes by willow dental group uh, next week uh, we will start the day after halloween which is tuesday november 1st and we will go all week through friday and we'll be doing that eight to five so all you got to do is bring your kid bring or even a Adults come in and they drop it off and some some ask for the money and some say just give it to the troops that's great oh, so nice. yeah we'll be here next week uh, Tuesday through Friday 8 to 5 and two dollars per pound up to five pounds love that I mean a couple bucks otherwise it's just gonna sit in your pantry or you're gonna eat it and as you said maybe overdo it now the candy is okay in moderation right but what happens from a dental and healthcare perspective if we have too much candy and especially if the little ones have too much candy for their teeth. Yeah, that's super important, and that's why we started this, because, again, I, hey, I love a nice piece of dark chocolate every <laughs> once in a while. It's great, you know, and I, I, I know my team. I see them snacking on chocolates. Actually, we have a bowl of chocolates, but, you know, we have plenty of toothbrushes and toothpaste and floss and water. You know, water is a, a great little neutralizer of sugar. So, you know, again, like I used to tell my kids, look, okay, the next three days after Halloween, I want you to barter, negotiate, trade, whatever you want with Get your pieces you like, and then we're going to consume three or four a day, and then after that, they're gone. So, again, it's really about moderation. It's finding the ones that you like. And I always encourage patients. You know, we want to try and stay away from the big full candy bars. We'd rather have like a little tiny piece of candy versus a big bar. And also, too, you know, we want to stay away from some of the things that last a long time, like lollipops and even licorice, I know. But some of these things really get in the grooves of our teeth. And even after brushing and flossing, sometimes they stick there and it's super hard to get out. And especially for kids that may be having it at lunchtime at school or something, they may be sitting in their teeth for another six, seven, eight hours. So we really want to try and make sure that the oral environment stays nice and neutral and not very acidic, which a lot of these candies and sugars do, which creates decay. Ooh, and that's what, and the decay, that can break down enamel. If you have a cavity, it could rot it, right, already, or filling. You have a filling, it can increase that. Yeah, so sometimes around a filling, if it's leaking, stuff can leak underneath the filling, and that can create cavities. And I'm even surprised because, you know, a lot of kids these days, they love these super sour things, and which I, I don't understand. I put it in my mouth, and it's like, <laughs> what? But they love these things, and these things are actually, they're very acidic, and some of them get close to battery acid, believe it or not. So if you could imagine putting some of these super sour things, and I know if you've ever had it, it's like, wow, well, that's that's like kind of like battery acid. So you wow. really got to make sure that you're not consuming a lot of these things and being careful with our teeth because once the enamel is gone, it's gone. You can't ever get it back. So okay. to protect it, especially on young kids that will have some of these teeth the rest of their life, super important. That is such a huge reminder for parents. I like what you said about water, too. You can flush out uh, some of that stuff by drinking a lot of water. And the fun size. You said these little ones might be your best friend. I think I've heard several people say, you know, moment on the lips, forever on the hips. But it could be better for your teeth, I guess. Uh, doctor, thank you so much. We want to put that graphic up one more time to let folks know when they can start bringing the candy in. Two bucks per pound. I mean, why not get a little cash back? Or you can just donate it because, as Dr. told 
told us this is for a great cause. The candy goes to service members, those who are serving, they get a little treat, um, something that reminds them of home via Move America Forward. Up on your screen there, you can come by and drop off November 1st. Now, doctor, uh, I know of at least one uh, Willow Dental location. Can they bring it to any location? We only have one location, Great. and we are at the corner of Herndon and Willow, and we are okay. 6753 North Willow Avenue. So feel free to come by, like I said, 8 to 5, and next week, Tuesday through Friday, and we'll see you here. All right, so post-Halloween, get your favorite ones and then bring the rest uh, off to drop off for a great cause. Dr. Sean Anderson with Willow Dental. Doctor, thanks so much for joining us.